Let's talk about our 404 page. If you've ever browsed a website and you accidentally typed in an invalid link on that site or even clicked on a link that took you to a page that no longer exists, you probably landed on what's called a 404 error page. This is a page that exists on your site as a landing pad for anyone that happens to enter a link to a page that doesn't exist. It keeps them on your site and usually provides some kind of helpful text or link back to the actual content of the site itself. Let's click into settings and click into 404 page. And here we have an option to customize our 404 page so that if anyone lands on it, you can use your own words and prompts to properly direct them back to where you want them to be. Let's click customize page. And here we get a simple template to work with using the same header and footer that you already have on the full site already. But as with any page in the builder, you can change anything. So we've got a fun little 404 graphic. It's just an image and it can be changed to whatever you want or removed completely if you don't want it. And then a little text box telling the user what happened. Again, you can make this whatever you want. You could type something more fun if you want, like, uh, whoops, are you lost? Let's get you back home. And then finally, a button here that you can use to direct them back to anywhere you want. And remember, this is just like a normal page, so you can add widgets, add text, color, video, whatever you want. And you can preview it the same way by going up here to preview, just like that. Or you can go back to settings, 404 page, and click preview page. And that gets you there as well. So make sure to visit here before you publish your site. It's another way to add just a little more character to your site and also helps prevent losing visitors if they accidentally happen to land here.